Hello friends, this is Durga from ITVersity, a one-stop stop learning portal for all the technologies. Typically, I upload a, a series of videos and create a playlist for those videos um, relate, related to a particular topic. And also, uh, while creating these videos, I try to um, group uh, several playlists uh, into categories. Uh, it could be in multiple dimensions, one is based on topic and one is based upon relevance. Um, and uh, as part of that, you, you can see a lot of getting started the playlists, uh, starting from Hadoop, uh, uh, setting up the environment and uh, uh, creating a POC with simple use case. And uh, uh, there are several other getting started as well for the uh, uh, HBase, for uh, uh, DynamoDB, etc. In the same context, I, uh, I am trying to upload a series of videos uh, under getting started um, for Cloud Foundry. Cloud Foundry is uh, a relatively new technology. I think it's two, three year old technology. And uh, uh, as part of this playlist, you will see the introduction of uh, Cloud Foundry, uh, which is this video. And then uh, you will sign up to public cloud services you will set up Cloud Foundry command line interface and then you will build a sample Spring Boot application and uh, you will push that Spring Boot application to Pivotal Web Services which is one of the public Cloud Foundry uh, um, uh, in platforms and then we will uh, also develop sample Node.js application using uh, uh, JavaScript as a uh, uh, programming language from uh, application development and then we will try to push that Node.js application to IBM Bluemix and then we will conclude. I will not get into too much uh, details about the Spring Boot or Node.js, but uh, this is primarily to showcase how you can leverage Cloud Foundry and push uh, the, uh, the applications um, into the, uh, uh, the public Cloud Foundry uh, services and then uh, access those applications uh, online. Uh, so, uh, you will see the end-to-end -end life cycle for uh, both Spring, uh, which we will be pushing into Pivotal Web Services, which is one of the Cloud Foundry provider. And also uh, uh, other one is Node.js to IBM Bluemix, another Cloud Foundry provider. Uh, so as part of that, we will uh, sign up to public cloud services. So there are two public cloud services, especially with Cloud Foundry. One is IBM Bluemix and second one is Pivotal Web Services. And uh, 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 typically, Cloud Foundry is used to uh, automate uh, 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 the deployment of your applications into the uh, uh, Cloud Foundry uh, uh, environment. And uh, uh, for that, you need to set up a, a Cloud Foundry command line interface. So we will download the command line interface as part of three. And we will try to authenticate ourselves to the public uh, cloud services, which are both uh, 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 Pivotal Web Services as well as IBM Bluemix. And then Spring is a Java based uh, uh, framework to build applications. I will just create a very simple uh, 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 a Spring Boot application um, which includes the container uh, for Tomcat and all those things. And then we will try to push that application into uh, Pivotal Web Services which is one of the Cloud Foundry services and then we will try to access um, by uh, using the URL. And then uh, we will uh, uh, develop sample Node.js application, primarily using the JavaScript. And we can actually set up uh, Node.js based uh, uh, environment in uh, uh, cloud services. In this case, we will uh, use Bluemix for that and we will try to push a sample Node.js application to Bluemix and try to access it. So, um, uh, you, uh, if you are not very clear about Cloud and Cloud Foundry, there will be another playlist which I will be uploading very soon, which will give you end-to-end -end, uh, overview about uh, how the hardware uh, uh, and also software have evolved and what is the relevance about Cloud, uh, what is private Cloud, what is public Cloud, what are different, service, uh, 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 different Cloud service providers that are available and what are the free services they provide to you all those things will be covered in a separate uh, playlist um, uh, sometime later but for now if you want to learn cloud foundry and uh, uh, start deploying your applications into uh, 
public uh, uh, cloud uh, providers, uh, this is the playlist to go. Targeted audience are any developer um, or uh, uh, release engineer who want to uh, deploy, uh, uh, develop and deploy their applications or just deploy their applications into cloud and you can learn something out of this playlist. That being said, I hope you will enjoy the content on this playlist. Uh, if you like the idea, please click on the like button. If you want to provide the feedback, please use the comment section of the video. And uh, if you have not subscribed to my channel yet, please do so. You will get to see a lot more content like this over time. Thank you. Bye.